The way Meg's views the game is second to none, and I think um, her character is is more um, quieter, but she's so emotionally intelligent with everyone, very kind person, so she picks up on little things that you don't necessarily notice um, yourself, and that's how she gets the best out of her players. Hello! I think the way that, yeah, she's an introverted person and the way that she sits back and observes even the game itself is, is incredible and she just mentions a few words to you when you're out there and you're like, oh my gosh, like you go out and you put put forward what she's told you and um, yeah, it just changes your whole game. So we're very lucky to have her at Firebird. Yeah, we might have a play area there. We'll have Olivia and Thomas on baby duty. <laughs> Look after these babies, please. Ah, oh, thanks. And then these are little gift bags for the kids. Firebirds, oh, they're going to like the purple balls. Olivia tells me purple is her favourite colour now. We go back around 25 years ago. Uh, we both started study, studying human movement together um, to be teachers, and um, yeah, we, we studied we studied together for four years. I, I think Megan's very qualified for the job. She's had some outstanding uh, mentors. She's been in two programs. She's been with the Swifts, she's been with Australian Diamonds, and she's also um, been an elite player. So she's going to do an amazing job um, with this group. I've had the joy of working with Megs with the Australian Diamonds um, the past couple of years and she's just got a wealth of knowledge that I try and tap into as much as possible. Um, I'm very lucky in that she's a former goal attack and, and a smart one in that so um, yeah she's just a phenomenal coach and she um, there's still so much belief in her, in her players and I can't believe that she's landed herself here as head coach of the Firebirds. I couldn't be happier. One. Ah, step, step. <laughs>